Pinning and depinning EDIS connectors is actually pretty easy. You don't need any special tools, stuff like this. You don't need it. Um, I just use a very small jewelers, and all I got to do is pry out this little red locking plate. So all I do is just sneak it under there, and then pull up on it, take this guy out. You can just barely see those three little plastic locks that click on top of the connectors. All I have to do is gently push my driver between that lock and between the pin. And now this will come right out. Just like that. And then of course paying attention to the orientation. Goes back in the same way. Through the weather seal. And then you'll hear a little click. And it's back in place. Once you're done soldering new ends or whatever, push that guy back in and the connector's reassembled.